Hey there. So, how's it going if you're in this COVID-19 isolation or lockdown? One thing to help your sanity is keeping up some regular physical activity. I think it really does help frustration. It helps frustration from sitting home and perhaps not doing nothing. Being stuck at home, yeah, that can prove to be very boring. It does mean you have to stay in your area, you know, stay away from the beach and not go to the other side of town. But that doesn't mean you can't go for, say, an hour or maybe a two-hour walk around your area, around your suburb. I've been doing a bit of this, and I have been often seeing people doing some work in their garage or maybe in their garden. But, once again, you can go for a walk as well. I also see people doing some work in their garden, pruning their hedges, weeding their gardens. So it's great to see getting some other work done that perhaps normally, if you're going to work, you wouldn't be able to get done. Going for that walk too, keeping up the physical activity, or starting more physical activity, helps save your sanity. And we know that exercise always helps or increases your self-esteem. So, how much activity have you been doing? Have you been going for that walk? Have you done that exercise? Remember, you do have to keep your distance from others. Two metres. That's what the deal is here in New Zealand. Many times I've walked past the supermarket and there's lines far at the door. I wonder how often these people go to the supermarket. At these times, you could probably just go maybe once a week, once every 10 days, if you really plan out what you need and when you need it. But I think there is a lot of people out there that go to the supermarket every day or two when there's no need to. You know, normally when they're working, they still continue to go to the supermarket many times. Cut that down to once a week. Plan what you're going to have for your meals, things like this. This will allow you to cut your visits right down. So once again, all the best with this isolation lockdown period. I know it's frustrating, but we can't do much about it. And let's hope that, say, a month, two months down the track, we're in a better situation, wherever you are in the world.